I knew I was gonna like it. Oh my god, I knew it. No makeup in the summertime, just applying this blush. <gasps> Oh yeah, this is a good shade. <laughs> this is a good idea, oh my god. Is this a hazard? So this is what I think everyone freaking needs. This is my portable charger right here. Okay, so I'm going in with a new foundation brush, which I've actually been obsessed with recently. Um, this is literally only my third time. But like, it literally like takes me like one try to get obsessed with something. <laughs> so if you guys know, um, basically I made like a haul a long time ago, like a couple months ago of just a bunch of random stuff that I bought, like makeup and all that stuff. Well, this is one of the brushes that I bought along with a kooky a uh, kabuki brush and a concealer brush from Hourglass. This is their Hourglass foundation brush. It rocks, honestly. Like, I was such a tried and true, true to my Beauty Blender, which I still am a tried and true to my Beauty Blender. But I don't know, I've just been like applying with a brush recently because I feel like my skin has just been like, I don't know. It tweaks out. It really does. So, I'm just applying it with this brush. And it's stunning. It literally applies it so well and so seamlessly. Like, do you guys first of all just see like how beautiful and gorgeous this foundation is? Like, if you have not tried it, literally try it. 100% there's some like magical voodoo stuff in this foundation. I don't know what it is. I'm like dying to get my hands on it like in the tan shade. I just don't know what my tan shade is and I haven't tanned. I actually think I'm going to do a glow up video. So if you guys want to see like a glow up video where we do like a glow up transformation, whatever. You know the drill. We wax the eyebrows, we do a pedicure, we do the nails, we do the self tan, we do the makeup, we do the hair. You guys get the drill. Like the entire shebang. I just love it. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So now we're, I'm so excited. Wait, oh my God, I'm so excited. Now we're gonna get into the fun part. The new makeup, guys. So we have this. Like literally, it's all in the original packaging. I haven't even swatched. Okay, okay. What are we gonna do first? We're definitely gonna do the bronzer first. So let's jump into the bronzer. This is NARS Laguna Cream Bronzer. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm actually like, okay. I can't believe we're actually... Like, she's gorgeous. Wait, I'm a little scared because I'm pale right now. I got this in the shade um, Laguna 2, the original. Oh, that's pigmented. Oh, wow. Wait, I need to get, like, my brush. I mean, my mirror. <laughs> oh, wow. I knew I was gonna like it. Oh my god, I knew it. You guys don't understand. This came out in like August, or I don't know if it came out in August, but I saw it in August because it's been saved on my Sephora since August. You guys, how many months is that of wanting this? We're just gonna blend that out a little bit. You guys, it's stunning, dude. Like, I literally wanna be tan now because I wanna see what this looks like. When I'm tan, oh, I put too much. Dude, it's beautiful. I've been like so into makeup TikTok recently and just like makeup videos. And I go through these phases. Like I never want to buy makeup, if that makes sense. Like I don't ever really have the desire to like go to Ulta and like buy makeup because I already have so much makeup. So like new products and new things don't really intrigue me. But I don't know, recently I've been like so totally into it. Dude, this bronzer is legendary. I'm not even kidding you. Like, I don't know if you guys can tell, but like in person, if you guys were here in person, like my forehead looks like what makeup artists like do to their clients. Like, oh my God, you guys, like this is stunning. Like shut the literal hell up. You guys, like my skin looks so good right now. Holy here is my, just love, honestly. I spray this in between my face whenever I do my makeup. Oh my God. I feel like it just helps bring the hydration back if we're losing hydration. I literally like cannot do my makeup without it. <laughs> I'm obsessed with it. And like, why does nobody use it? Like nobody uses it. Everyone like hates on Mario Badescu. I don't get it. Mario Badescu, if you literally ever want to work with me, I'm a lover. I'm not a hater like all these other girls, okay? We're gonna go in with this NARS Creaming Concealer. We blended it out with a brush. <sighs> It's just so lightweight under the eye. I'm kind of like obsessed with it. 
I'm just gonna put a little bit of concealer under the eye. This is again the Hourglass. This is one of the other Hourglass brushes that I got. I've been like on a hunt for an under eye concealer that doesn't feel like I'm wearing concealer and does not look like I'm wearing concealer at all. And definitely I think this is like the winner. Like obviously I have concealer under my eyes right now, but you cannot tell. And when you go up really, really close to my eyes, it looks like there is literally no concealer under my eye whatsoever. It's kind of like insane. It's so good. I need to get my hands on that orgasm blush. That's like the one thing that I have not tried. Okay. Now we're going to go in with this. This is the Kylie Glow Bomb, Lip and Cheek Glow Bomb and Pink Me Up. I've been wanting to try this. I'm not even kidding you since November. Bianca bought this for me in November and obviously she couldn't give it to me until Christmas time. So I've essentially been waiting like two months to use this. I see it all over my TikTok. It's so beautiful. It looks like this. So like they usually do it with their hands, but I don't really like to apply things with my hands, so I don't know what to do. Should we like try it with our hands? I guess we're just gonna try it with our hands because everyone does it with their hands. Oh, that's pretty. It really does just like blend into the skin. Okay, I know for the summertime, I'm gonna be like all up in this. No makeup in the summertime, just applying this blush. <gasps> yeah. Oh yeah, so it's definitely more color pigment if you use a brush. Oh my god, this is really pretty. The combination of this bronzer and this blush is just making my skin look so freaking glowy in person. Beautiful. Okay, the last thing that we need to do really, really quick. This isn't new. The Sweetener Concealer by Ariana Grande. And I haven't decided, like, the shade is like, if you look at the shade, it is completely, like, just, like, off. But it kind of works carving out underneath my, like, contour. It's nice for, like, a carve out. Like, I'm going to blend it out and you guys tell me. Do you think that it matches? Like, should I keep on to it? I can't tell. But I think the forehead needs to be a little bit more, like, lighter. It's this concealer brush. I think it's called like the Vanish Concealer Brush. I don't know. Just look up Hourglass Concealer Brush. Yeah, she fucking rocks. The brushes are kind of expensive, but I definitely do. I'm like, yeah, those, the hose is worth the money. Here's my Laura Mercier, and they came out with a new Laura Mercier. They came out with one that's called Ultra Blur. And so, like, I've been wanting to try this out, but I haven't finished this one. And I want to, like, finish this one, you know, before we, like, completely take out a new one. Where's my set the face? I'm just using my little powder puff. I have these linked on my Amazon if you guys want the exact ones that I use. I've been actually loving them. As you guys know, I was setting my face with a beauty blender. And don't get me wrong. Setting your face with a beauty blender is amazing and it diffuses your skin really nicely. But this has been really nice recently. This video is going to be so freaking long. My apologies if you guys don't like long videos. Comment down below. Do you guys like long videos? Because I feel like my last few videos have been long. Yeah, like they've been in like the 20-30 minute range. Do you guys like that? Or do you guys like, like, shorter videos? I don't know. Now we're gonna try the Charlotte Tilbury. I'm so freaking excited, you guys. Like, I literally feel like a TikTok girly right now with all this, like, new makeup. Everybody on TikTok uses this. I literally only know about it because of TikTok. It's never been touched. It's so beautiful. <gasps> okay, okay. Oh my god. Okay, I'm literally so freaking excited. I've wanted this bronzer for so long, but it's like expensive. Like, why is it $56? I don't know. This is also gonna literally last me 900 years. Oh yeah, that's pretty. It's like a nice little combo. Yeah, that's actually really pretty. Okay, so let's test it down the neck. I've seen like all the girls on TikTok use this. I'm literally never, I've actually seen a girl run out of this. I don't know how she ran out of this. Like she went and got a new pan and all that stuff. I saw it on TikTok and I was like, girl, how did you run out of that? Because my Hula one, you guys know, like my Hula one is like my girl. I'm obsessed with Hula. And I've had that Hula bronzer for probably like six years. No, that's probably exaggerating. No, that's really not exaggerating actually. I probably had it for like six years, the same one and it still has not. I've had literally the exact same one for like six years and it still like hasn't run out. So we're definitely going to be keeping this 
probably for the remainder of my life. I'm going to be 35 using the same bronzer. Can't wait. This is the NARS little blush palette that I showed you guys. It's so beautiful. I love blush palettes. I'm just really into like blush right now. I, I, I've always been into blush. I've always had so many blushes, but like right now it's been like blush crazy. Oh my God, you're lying. I haven't opened her since Christmas. It's so freaking beautiful. I don't know what shade to use. I think I want to dip into that shade and then this bright pink one up here. I don't really know, girl. We're just gonna... It's so pretty. There's literally stars in it that I don't want to ruin it. Oh yeah, that's pretty. A nice just little flush of color. The combo is really... Okay, I'm gonna like sit from afar so you guys can kind of see. Do you see? That compared to that. The combo is really pretty. It's so pretty. Like you guys, tell me this is not the prettiest freaking thing. It's like so amazing that all of this is turning out so beautiful. Oh my God, this just like, it makes me want to get ready more. I think that's why I'm buying new makeup because when I have new makeup and all that stuff, it just makes me want to get ready more. You get the vibe. And then the highlighter, we're going to go in with the Kylie and Stoss highlighter. That's the one that I've been using. Literally already kind of has like a dent in the highlighter. Do you see where it kind of messed up the name? I'm like so sad, like, because this is so freaking pretty. You guys know I'm addicted to Amrezy. But you guys know they don't sell that anymore. So I'm trying to like use her sparingly. Like do you see that? That is just a stunning glow. This is in the shade Bestie Energy. It's from the Kylie and Stoss collection. Comment down below, have you guys tried the Rare Beauty Highlighters? Because I really want to get my hands on them. I was totally thinking about buying one, but then I was like, I never use this one. So I need to like really, really get my use out of this one, I feel like, before. I buy a new one so comment down below have you guys tried it because i really 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 want to try it you guys know that i'm a highlighter queen and i cannot deal without my highlight especially my nose highlight you guys know the nose highlight and then the inner corner highlight that's just like my signature so freaking pretty i just love a good nose highlight it just really does it for me every time like i'm depressed and then i put on nose highlight and like suddenly i'm cured with my tried and true Baking powder. Anastasia Beverly Hills. If you're watching this video, please put me on your PR list. Like, literally, please. You're definitely not watching this, but I'm probably going to tag the product below in hopes that you'll see it. Please. Like, please sponsor me. You don't even have to sponsor me. You don't even have to pay me. Like, please just put me on your PR list because I see a lot of people that I know on your PR list, okay? And I make more makeup content, but they're on it. Like, and I'm not on it. And, like, I'm not trying to be a hater. I'm really happy for them, but, like, I want to be happy for me too. I got the lip liner on. Now, do I want to go in with the lipstick or do I just want to go in with the gloss? Okay, so I don't really know what to do because we have two different sets of lip glosses, like new lip glosses. So I have these new CoverGirl Yummy Glosses, which I'm like obsessed with. These just came out. They're on Ulta.com. So if you guys want to purchase them, I made a TikTok on them. So if you guys want to like see how they apply all that stuff, they're like scenty and they're really nice. And then I also have two new Rihanna glosses. So it's like, do we do the Rihanna gloss or do we use, do the new CoverGirl ones? I'm kind of feeling the red ones. So do we do the new CoverGirl ones? These are incredible. I found them the other day when I was, I was browsing on Ulta and they had just freaking released these. I bought them so freaking quick. I'm not even kidding you. I don't think they're available in store yet. Um, So you do have to buy them online. They're like $10.99 or whatever. CoverGirl, if you're watching this, please send me the entire collection. But this one's in the shade, You're Just Jelly. First of all, like, look at the wands you guys like the wand is so beautiful they're freaking like huge um if you guys have nyx lip glosses like this is like a nyx lip gloss compared to like if we put the wand in it like this is a nyx lip gloss compared to it like they're freaking huge um they also smell really good this one smells like fruit punch this specific scent i haven't used this one yet it smells like fruit punch and i love it okay Oh yeah, this is a good shade. <laughs> this is a good idea. Oh my god. Oh girl. It's so... I don't know how to explain it. Like, silky. Like, you go... And it's so silky. It's not sticky. It's not, like, gooey. I don't know how to explain it. Like... 
Oh, I literally love these. Do they taste good? Honestly, yeah. This is so pretty. Like, I literally think these are going to be the lip glosses of 2023. Like, I'm not even kidding you. Like, cover girl. Please sponsor me. You don't even have to sponsor me. You don't even have to pay me. Well, I would really love to get paid, but like, um, the entire collection, girl. Put me on your PR list, please. For these, specifically. It's like, my vanity is a disaster right now, and I want to show you guys. It's not as bad as it usually gets, but like, girl. We're looking a little kind of crazy over here. Hey. So we usually do our hair or something like that. Should we crimp my hair? Cause my hair is like, this is how it dried naturally last night. And it's kind of like looking crimpedish. To be honest, I literally could just get away with not doing my hair today. It's kind of like pretty, is it not? And like, this isn't that crazy up here. I would just have to like hairspray it. So maybe we're just going to keep the hair natural. Like you guys, like all the makeup products. They're given. Okay, so we need to pick out an outfit. I feel kind of stressed out because I'm like racing the sun right now and I don't really know what to wear. I like don't know what to wear and I'm kind of like stressed out right now. And every time that I'm stressed out, like have to go to the bathroom. Like I literally feel like I'm going to shit my pants every time that I'm stressed out. And to be honest, like I'm stressed out and I have anxiety 24-7 so I constantly feel like I have to go to the bathroom. I have this cute little hat that I have never like worn from Fashion Nova. And I've been like wanting to take an Instagram picture with it. You guys saw it in like my one haul and I still haven't worn it. Maybe we'll take like an Instagram picture in it. But what outfit? I don't know what to wear. You guys look at how cute it looks right here actually. So you guys know that my little sister got me these for Christmas and so I just put them right here on my mirror. And it just looks so freaking cute. Just like sitting right there. I have it on this little like container. I mean this little like glass thing I got from the thrift store. But it's just all lined up and it looks so beautiful. Does it not? Then I have my Ariana perfumes right there. Okay, I think we figured it out. Well, we didn't figure out the bottom part. But I think we figured out the top part. So I have this little like pink shirt. It's long sleeve. I've had it for months now and I've never worn it. It's from this brand called M E M I M L. I don't freaking know. Should I turn that lighting on so you guys can see? Okay. But it looks like this. It's like pink long sleeve and it has this cute little... Do we do a white skirt? But I should start my period today, so that's scary. Should it be a white skirt or should it be like a black skirt? Because I have a black skirt. This like little like black frilly skirt. Which would look really cute, but would the white one look better? Okay. This is the white one. Right? Sorry, Chanel's dog's toys right there. But that's kind of cute. That with like a white, right? Or is that fucking ugly? I don't know. Maybe I should like try it on and then see. Girl, I don't freaking know. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna go put this on and then I'm gonna like... I gotta find a bra and like underwear. Okay, hold on. Okay, I just put a bra on. This shirt's new and like my makeup... I'm scared. So I need to like find like a bag to like put over my head. Is this a hazard? Because there's not a... Okay, I'm just taking this like... Okay. Is this a hazard? Wait, I'm scared. I can't. Wait. Wait, I literally can't see a single thing. Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. I need to get this shirt ready because I'm panicking. Wait, I'm like scared. My heart's. Why am I scared to do this? But I'm scared. Like, what if it doesn't go over? What if I start like dying? How <laughs> did I get it over my. Okay, wait. <laughs> Maybe this bag's too big. Okay, wait. Let's try this bag. Warning. Please keep away. This bag is not a toy. Yeah, girl. Is my head even going to fit in this one? My head is not even going to fit in that one. It's that big. Would my head fit in this bag? Okay, let's try this one. Oh my god, you guys. I got this cute ass little set. I want to take a picture in it today, but I have an envisionment that I'm going to be in a parking garage when I take a picture. Okay. Dude, my head is so big. Okay, wait, we're going to do this. Do I just go back to this bag? But I'm scared. It's just so big. Okay, wait. It just needs to be smaller. Like, why are you so freaking big? Okay, we're gonna try this again. I literally can't breathe and my eyelashes are like smashed. Oh god. Wait. Wait, what's going on? <gasps> wait. <laughs> Is that how I looked when I came out of my mom's vagina? I'm sweating a little bit. That was scary. 
Well, I guess now, even if I don't want to wear this shirt, we have to commit to it because how the fuck am I supposed to take this off? God, that like really smashed down my eyelashes. Like, are they still there? The lip's still in check, okay, girl. So this is the shirt. It's really cute. Okay, wait. Now let me put on the white skirt. Gotta zip it up on the side. The hell? Okay, so here's the dilemma. So we can either do a little boots moment, but I don't know if you're gonna be able to see the boots in my picture. I have these ones. No, they're not Balenciaga ones. So you can get them from Amazon. But I have those ones. But do we think it would be really cute as like a little heel moment? And then like take some pictures to where you could see the see the heels maybe. Like a cute little like pink girly vibe. Cause I've never worn these heels. Ugh, they're a little big. But these are a size seven, so how are they a little big? Okay, like do you see? Like, that's like a really cute moment. I finally got the little Olaplex bonding oil. So, girl, we really are part of the TikTok girly community. Like, so we're going to put it in. I haven't really used it because I'm trying to, like, use it sparingly, but. Why is it, like, hard to get out? Yeah, I decided to just keep my hair natural today because it's kind of like these cute little, like. I don't know. It's almost like looks like I crimped my hair in a way. But I didn't. It's like these cute little like just like I don't know, pretty like wave. I love this hairspray and I'm almost out of it. Okay. I have this linked on my Amazon if you guys are curious. I just have so many baby hairs and it's kind of annoying. Kim Kardashian lasered hers off. And like, I get it every day. I like, understand, girl. Because I want to laser mine off too. But then, didn't she? I think she said that she regrets lasering it off, so I probably would regret it. So, like, probably good that we're not. The shirt's like messing with the camera. Do you guys see that? It's like making you guys like, making me look like a green screen. So, I wanted to do a haul. I have an addiction to online shopping. There's one thing in particular that out of this entire haul you literally need. It's life-changing for everyone. So the first thing that's like off camera that I know is an extension cord. I had to get a new extension cord because guess what? Um, the other day I was like vacuuming and like I hit my extension cord with the vacuum and then it started to like spark and I was really scared and then there was like a burn on one of my plugs. So I had to get a new extension cord. That was fucking scary. The next thing that I got is this little like tripod thing. Ima Bob. So it looks like this and it's a tripod and it's really amazing because it like can just, it's compact. But what you do is you like push this button at the bottom. I have this linked on my Amazon if you guys are curious. And then it opens the legs and then it goes like this. And then like you stick your phone right here. And then if you want to like turn your phone sideways or whatever, you can go like that and stick your phone like that. And then this goes like super freaking tall, but it's amazing because then it's just all compact and then it goes like this. And what's also really cool is that it has a remote so you can like take pictures and stuff like so it's just already attached. It's like an all in one thing. I'm actually obsessed with it. Um, the next thing that I got is just, you know, like the little like the light that's like all over Amazon. But like you see like the lighting, it's like pretty iconic. I'll have this one linked. It's honestly amazing. Um, I've used it probably like 15 times now or whatever it's pretty freaking cool i just have a bunch of big lights and i love my big lights for filming like right now i'm filming with one of my huge lights like the light that i'm filming with is probably like this like big compared to this one you know um but this one's just nice you know to like fit in your bag like it fits perfectly in my bag the next thing that i got are these little cuticle pens i'm actually obsessed with them two of them are missing right now because i have one in my purse and then i have one right here um so the orange one and the vanilla one are missing but it comes with pineapple cherry lavender apple um, but yeah, it's just basically like a cuticle pen and I'm obsessed with it and you just go like this and then you just like draw it on your cuticles. Um, I don't know. It makes your manicure and like your nails just like last and look more better, you know, like you don't get like those like crusty hands. And then it's also really, really nice to just keep this in your bag because then like if you're wearing heels or whatever and like your, he like your feet are dry or something like that, you can just go like this on your toes. And then this right here. Okay. So this is what I think everyone freaking needs. This is my portable charger right here. This is freaking iconic. I'm obsessed with this. I've literally used this so many times that it's well worth the freaking money. I actually got this one on sale and I think it's actually currently still on sale right now, but 
this portable charger is incredible and I'm going to tell you guys why. So you know like most portable chargers, you have a bunch of cords, blah, 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 so freaking annoying. This one literally like fits in your purse. Also, it just plugs into the wall. Like you plug it into the wall and that's how it freaking charges. And then it already comes pre with a iPhone cord and it comes pre with an Android cord. And it also comes with this that if you wanted to plug in like another cord, like it's basically an all thing in one. This is the best thing ever. I'm not even kidding you. I use this almost every single freaking day because like, you know, like I'd be like in my room and then I, you know, I want to go to the toilet and like sit on the toilet for a while. And like my phone's going to die. So I bring this with me. I bring this to the grocery store. I literally bring this. Like I brought this to the movies. I bring this to restaurants. Like this is amazing. Like, okay. So now let's go on to makeup. So I guess we'll do Ulta. Um, so the first thing that I got is this cleanser right here. Here. So this is the it confidence in a cream cleanser. This is literally like my favorite cleanser ever I love I love Skincare in general. So I have a lot of cleansers that I like I have a lot of serums all this stuff This just makes my skin feel so luxurious. I tried this for the first time like two years ago I got like a set for Christmas that I really, really wanted to try out and I fell in love with the cleanser and it was amazing And I fell in love with it so much that I actually bought two bottles This one is like brand new like hasn't been used yet, but I have a bottle currently in the shower right now then I got this foundation which I don't know about this I think I like hella color match myself wrong at first I thought it was good and then like when I swatched it I was like oh girl um so this is the Anastasia Beverly Hills luminous foundation I've been wanting to try this for forever I think I really just wanted to try it because I like the bottle the bottle is like really aesthetically pleasing and like just really, really pretty I love yeah I just like how sleek and nice it looks um yeah I don't like obviously I'm pale right now so this is not my shade but I like swatched it like when I was tan and like I think it's too yellow so I think I may return this again but like here's the thing like I just like I think I'm just gonna take the L because like I don't like returning things and it gives me anxiety and the last time that I returned something they like gave me like store credit which that's I love store credit but like bitch put it on a gift card like I can't even like I literally cannot use it online so like I would have to go buy things in store and I don't like buying things in store and I don't like going in store so I think I might just like count take my loss or whatever I don't freaking know the next thing that I got is um one of the lip oils this is the raspberry drip one it's so freaking pretty I've been really into like lip oils lip glosses I mean I've always been into lip glosses lip oils but like I've been really into fucking lip oils recently and so I've just been wanting to buy them all and this one's super super pretty and pink and then like the wand has like a metal thing on it that's why I wanted it because it was really cool. It's like different. It has like a little metal thing. So I think it's supposed to be like cooling on your lips. I don't know. I haven't used it yet. Also got another lip oil, but this is like an Ulta Beauty lip oil and like I'm addicted to it. It's so gorgeous. I don't have it on right now, but I kind of want to put it on. Is it going to ruin the color of my lips? Because it's kind of tinted purple. Yeah, kind of like tinted. The kind of tinted purple, purple. But yeah, the Ulta Beauty Lip Oil. Like, yeah, pop off, girl. Literally, she's so bomb. Okay, the next thing that I got, I'm really excited about. I have not used this yet. Literally haven't even swatched it. Haven't even freaking touched it because I don't want to ruin it. This is the ColourPop Lizzie McGuire collection. And first of all, this packaging. Like, I'm going to keep this blush in this packaging forever just because it's so freaking pretty. When you open it, it's even pretty again. Like, are you literally kidding me? I was obsessed with Lizzie McGuire as a kid, like literally up freaking obsessed. Okay, Lizzie McGuire was my thing. Okay, and um, one of my first ever concerts was Hilary Duff. So, girl, we're an OG -er over here. But I literally like it still has like, the plastic on it. Look at how stunning this blush is. It's a really really pretty pink, and then it kind of has some glitter in it. I have not tried it yet. I think I'm going to get ready tomorrow, um, and then like film me trying this or whatever. I'm trying to get myself like just excited with makeup again. I used to be obsessed with makeup, like addicted to makeup, where I would do my makeup like multiple times. I would seriously do it in the morning and then take it off and then redo it again at nighttime because I was so obsessed with doing my makeup. And then I kind of just like got really depressed and like lazy and like I just don't want to do makeup anymore. But all of my products seriously have been making me want to do my makeup i've been like excited with getting ready um again today like you guys know i tried all of my other like um christmas makeup out so i can't wait to like try the rest of this stuff like the blush i'm so freaking excited for everything so i'll try and like if i can i'll try and like link some of this stuff that i bought i probably can link almost everything and then for the amazon stuff i'll have those like linked on my amazon or whatever we're gonna go take off my makeup now because i've had it on for a very very long time Oh, 
He smells so luxurious. It just melts in the way.